because my hair was not doing well at all <laughs> but mainly um, because mainly I didn't take care of it and this is the result of not taking care of something that you have been given you're the most beautiful you're the most beautiful no other girl Hello and welcome back to my channel. This is Bakolile Ayeni, but you can call me Mrs. Ayeni. If you are new here, welcome <laughs> and thank you so much for tuning in today. But if you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back again for yet another video. And maybe I should say welcome to October, everyone. <laughs> it's wonderful. Uh, it's a new month. It's a new season. And it is the last um, term for the month. So I'm so grateful to God that I get to be alive by this time of the year. Yes, it's been... Um, a wonderful year nine months have passed us by and we all all the glory and all the praise to god for bringing us this far all right and the latest update that i have on me if you know me you would notice that i've cut my hair <laughs> i did a big chop oh my god and after i did that big chop <laughs> the insecurity that built up in me was like I don't think I can pick up my phone and do another vlog or do another video until my hair grew but I was like I ain't gonna wait for that <laughs> but uh, yeah because um, gr growing up I've always thought that I can't do a, a, a shortcut or do plaited hair because I've always thought that my hair is big and yeah <laughs> but um, I think I just need to embrace um, the head that I have and embrace my body and embrace everything that I am and who I am and yeah this is me <laughs> so I'm cutting off all insecurities and anything that is holding me back because of the things that I think are limiting me or are not making me to be who I am in this season of my life so yeah I finally did the big job and I'm here today shooting the video and I will definitely upload it <laughs> so yeah it's October and I also want to participate on the October so this is the note that you are starting on that I've cut my hair, I've let go of my hair and mainly the reason why I had to cut off my hair was because I was not taking care of it the way that I was supposed to. So I was not or I didn't have like a regular... Guys! I've cut my hair as you can see. <laughs> It's something that I wanted to do for such a long time and I did it in September after my birthday. So this is how I've been for the past two or oh, yeah, almost two weeks now of having a low cut on my hair. Like my hair was not doing well at all. <laughs> But mainly um, because mainly I didn't take care of it and this is the result of not taking care of something that you have been given so this is how I'll be rocking my hair and I'm still I'm, I'm still trying to find like a natural hair routine and the best products that I can use to take care of my hair but I've not so if you have any hair care lines that you like me to try out please do recommend down on the description oh, no <laughs> please do recommend down on the comment section what type of products that you are using for yourself if you are uh, natural hair and yeah or, or if you have any other products that you like that are working pretty well for yourself because um for quite a long time i've been trying to be a natural girl i think i started way in 2009 10 ish but by that time i didn't have access to youtube so i was just doing it and my hair is like a really coily 4c hair type so it's really thick and black and all of that so i've been trying a lot of products but they've not been working well or i have not been consistent <laughs> in using them so i think after this this is my third um big chop so <laughs> yeah <laughs> we've been chopping off this hair and it's been growing back and still we've not been taking care of it so <laughs> this time i'm gonna try to take care of it 
but yeah this is me this is the new me in this new month in this new season so it's gonna be an absolutely fantastic time so i think um that's what I, I want to focus more towards the end of this year really big being big on self-care and taking care of my body because i think sometimes as christians we like to take care of our spiritual life our mental health and all of those and all of those things but sometimes we neglect our physical body uh, especially after having babies <laughs> yeah, as women our bodies change a lot and then you are not the same person that you used to be so taking care of it or getting into the routine of taking care of this new body it has to be something that I need to do, I must confess. <laughs> but yeah, here we are. Um, today, the kids, they are um, on holiday for this one week. So I'm with them. So today, I think we're going to have to go and do some shopping because people are eating. Boys, they eat a lot. <laughs> so I have to stock up on my groceries so that we've got food to keep them for the whole week. And yeah. I think that's what we're gonna do today and then also i want to show you i've been juicing <laughs> it's been like a week or two now since i've been juicing but i don't have a juicer so i use a blender and then i just strain out the the other things <laughs> so i just strain out the pulp and then the other remaining juice extracts and then i use it as my juicer it's been good so far i'm enjoying it but i hope that i'll continue and it's because it's summer and it's time for us to eat healthy take care of our body take care of our hair take care of our minds take care of our spirit as well yes i think this is me i've been talking a lot so let's go <laughs> okay quickly before we leave i need to make them a little sandwich one wants chocolate spread and the other one wants peanut butter so that's what they're having this is one and i always have to make sure that i cut it in the shapes that they want <laughs> this is a square here Danny. i started juicing and this is the juice that i did yesterday here i've got um carrot um nachis um pineapple and cucumber and a little bit of ginger and water so i don't have a juicer yet so i'm currently using a strainer <laughs> i bought this strainer from pep last week so i just blend all of my um vegetables and fruits that i want to use and then I blend and strain and this is what I have. It's been nice so far. I like using my new cup. <laughs> it's been very, very nice. Um, last week I did a green one. And the boys didn't like it. But this one, they love it. Mm, it smells so fresh. <laughs> Amazing. Guys, are you ready? Yeah. Where where are we going? To shop. To shop. All right. And, and to go to aquarium. And go to aquarium. Yeah. Today. Yeah. <laughs> Not today. <laughs> yeah. We have a list here. Oh. Okay. All the things Did that you have. Yes, he's using it. Yes. Are you using it? Yes, we are using it. Oh. <laughs> Yay! Pick and pay flagship store. I miss pick and pay, do I? <laughs> we have my pick and pay, guys. Come this side, where are you going? I gave him his own trolley because he will not let me rest. Okay, let the shopping begin.
We are home. We are home, sweet home. I bought vinegar finally because I've been following. My name is Bani Tlapo and I am a housekeeper. <laughs> and she cleans everything one cup of warm water and one cup of vinegar. So I'm joining the Bani Tlapo gang. And then I just bought a Cajun spice. I wanna try out. I want to try this out because I've never used it before and I got these ones too and the normal rosary things because we are baking a lot so we had to buy a bigger um, baking powder we make pancakes, muffins with our flour so we don't really buy any pre-mix anymore so yeah then there's no vegetables and no chicken at the stores i don't know what's happening so i have to buy this chicken it looks small but it was fresh and it, it was a fresher amongst the ones that i saw and then i bought this porky mix because i normally cut up my own veggies and make my own um veggie mix but today we just had to buy this and then tomorrow I will go and look for other veggies from the other stores but for today these are the things that I bought and yeah let me continue unpacking <laughs> You call me by my name The love you give me I just can't deny No longer blinded I can see you I'm on my way to meet you We gotta talk, you know 
All these trials and tribulations got me tired, I need rest. And I heard that I can come to you when weary of my flesh. Alrighty, guys, it's been a good day, productive day, but I'm so tired now. So I'll see you guys tomorrow on the next vlog. I'm so tired and our food is ready and we didn't even continue cooking we just did the chicken and the veggies but the chicken is not as nice as I had expected the Cajun spice maybe I don't really understand it but <laughs> it's not as nice as the hype that I've seen online so we'll try again next time with a, with a different method and check out the recipes also but it's been a good day i'm so tired i want to sleep <laughs> i'll see you guys tomorrow thank you for watching bye god just tell me what you need for me